Sup fans, you are tuned in to the channel Eeps. I'm your host, Eatmon, episode 92. And I have a very special announcement to make. I have reached my 100th subscriber. Thank you very much, everyone. Really much appreciate it. I've been doing these channel Eep episodes day by day. Now on the 92nd day, episode 92. And yeah, I started off with just, you know, documenting sort of like a diary video blog of the day to day or behind the scenes or just sort of like talk about, well, not sort of, but I, I am talking about my experience as a digital artist, artist first, of course. And how that all manifested into becoming a creative entrepreneur um, here and now. It's been a long journey uh, in my creative career in almost 20 years experience. Oh my God. And it's been always been focused with Eatmon. You know, like I did everything on my own. Of course, I worked in some, got some experience bringing some um, design studios, worked in institutions. I even taught, I was a, a lecturer at colleges, given workshops, keynote speaking and all that. But all that had to do with the fact that I'm a digital artist, I'm a creator and my ability to be an entrepreneur and just sort of like reaching out to new audiences and being digital first, I think intrigued a lot of people of how I was able to traverse into different industries, a very STEAM, science, technology, engineering, arts, mathematics approach to my creativity. So that was what I felt I needed to express and talk about for Channel Eeps. And I'm not, you know, an individual who is like, please subscribe and everything. I mean, please do subscribe. But that is not my MO. My MO is really to get my story out into the world because I believe it needs to be heard and whether or not people like it or not, listen or not, subscribe or not, it doesn't matter because in theory, it was up on the internet. It is f pretty much forever. And it's important to document it. So I thank you all for the 100 subscribers who have joined me in this adventure, in this endeavor. And you can be sure that I'm just scratching, scratching the surface. Very much so. Because I'm sure if I dig deeper into my history, I could share a lot of personal experiences as a digital creator. And I'm sure a lot of up and coming, aspiring, illustrators, artists, designers, creative industries in general, would like to hear from a source that's been in the thick of it, that's been in the front lines in design, not all talk. My world is, is all talk and all, fa and, and all action. That's my world. The hardest we creators, as I always mention, we have the hardest gigs in the game because not only do we have to create, you know, we're actionable, but we also have to know how to talk it. Now that's like the, another skill set and another art form to its own. I think that they can be learned. Some people can have are natural speakers and they can really like uh, just go off on a tangent. 
But I tell you, when I public speaking for me, I I remember I think it was grade three. There was a public speaking competition. And I got uh believe it or not, I got first place. But you wouldn't believe how hard it was. The rehearsing, you know, memorizing. And my, my mom would be so strict with me, making sure that I got everything right. But I was nervous as heck. Public speaking, uh, I it was, I remember, I still remember to this day. Like those moments were very memorable. Because it really impacted me in a very, you know, emotional uh yeah just very emotional uh i'm from the get-go i always had butters butterflies in my stomach. always got nervous i remember i did another public speaking uh following up i think it was grade four i remember these things grade four and i had it all ready to say ready to go but then i had a um what's the word i had a um a, 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 a mind block or, or, or something like I, I completely forgot my lines. I, I blanked out in front of the, everyone and it was, Oh, it was so hard. But now, um, but you know, it's, it's a skill. It's something you learn over time. And I've learned that when you're speaking, um, I try not to really memorize lines at all. I just gotta, I gotta communicate based on how I feel. So I guess that's why that through my many conversations, many presentations, you know, I got better and better to the point that I can now just go off on a tangent in front of a computer screen. And, uh, and I hope I'm not boring you to death, <laughs> but 100 subscribers is a nice milestone. And I know that there's not much interactions, but please do like and subscribe. Much appreciate it. Uh, and I will always uh, continue to put out content. It's not going to be long. Uh, it could be between 10 to 15 minutes. But again, as I mentioned, very important to highlight and document my, my, my creative endeavors. About the past, about the present, and also about the future. Yep. Yep. So happy 100. 100. You know where it's at, y'all. So on that note, tomorrow, I've been invited to speak at a college. Well, it's a Gonkin college. Tomorrow uh, to a class of uh, creators. So I'm just finishing up my presentation slides. Um, I've got a little video reel I want to show them. And really, I hope to inspire and uh, I'm sure they'll have lots of questions. So looking forward to that. And yeah, can you believe it, folks? Tomorrow, it's Wednesday already, actually. It's the 14th. But uh, Thursday, yeah, tomorrow, Thursday, we're already at halfway point of the month of august like where where did the time go like as we get older like time just just goes so quick just so quick like what the eck nordy marketing and media is talking about back to school and people coming back from vacation and september rolls around and then then i'm off to the bath forum September 5th to the 7th. It's going to be a fantastic... I'm looking super looking forward to it. Uh, and uh, I will ensure that I will take you along in my channel, Eeps, when I'm over there. And what's exciting, folks, is that, you know, when you're, in, when you're doing these things, when you're... Look, in my previous episodes, I was talking about when you're traveling, you know, you don't really know what the expectations are. Uh... Uh, but you know, I, 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 every time I go somewhere and travel, uh, and especially, no, well, I, I, it's always work related, no matter what, because you know, I'm, I'm a creator and I go there and creative industries everywhere. 
I guarantee, like, for me, there's always a positive outcome. Always positive outcome. No matter what. So this forum is going to be very interesting because I never experienced um, a, a annual forum in its 20th, I think it's the 23rd um, uh, annual event when they bring leaders from all industries, government, you know, academia, business, all these. And I don't know who they are. But they're going to be there to be speaking, and just going to it'll be such a, a a a diverse group of voices talking about the future of my country, Canada, policy decisions like within the nation and our reach internationally. Isn't that amazing? Like that's that's so that's be such a such an incredible experience. And my contribution would be certainly I'm, I'm going to be on a position of listening, and also I will provide my point of view of how the creative industries steam play innovation fosters innovation, propels innovation opportunities and i believe canada is, is has the right ingredients for that so these things have been on my mind uh you know it is august and uh the and the forms come up real soon by the way you see how i digress so much like i, I just like i just i'm just like shabu 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 just, just like talking like pecha gucci style just kept, keep on going but uh one yeah i mean i'm just trying to like kill the time because I'm, I have to go above up of uh, past 10 minutes, <laughs> but this is subscribers 100. Thank you so much. I much appreciate it. Um, and please like and subscribe. Let's keep the momentum going. Cause uh, it's going to be, uh, it's going to be a crazy ride folks. 2025, just around the corner. You know where it's at. All right. It's very late and I'm going to bed. See my eyes got bags and all I say. Okay. Have a great evening, have a great afternoon, have a great morning, wherever you are in the world. This is The Channel Eves, episode 92, and I'll speak to you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.